Extreme sailor Harold Sedlicek is getting ready to sail back across the Atlantic. About a month ago, he finished his 87-day trip from Spain in a boat made from a new recyclable material made out of volcanic fibers. We test the new product. It's the first boat that exists. I built the boats. A lot of people have sailed across the Atlantic, but nobody has done it like Harry has here in a boat no bigger than a Ford Fusion. Plus, he's done it by himself with no help non-stop. I make two records. One was from coast to coast with the smallest boat and the second record was that I do 5,608 nautical miles without stopping. Sleeping quarters were tight. <laughs> he mainly ate cereal, noodles and candy bars for the 87-day trip and almost ran out because the trip took longer than expected. I lose like 20 pounds on the whole trip. He had to work for his water, pumping this device to make fresh water from seawater for about an hour and a half every day. His biggest challenges were being alone on such a small boat for such a long time, and of course, the weather. The most what I was afraid was the four times when I hit with my mast the water. There I had 45 knots of wind and big sea. That wasn't enough to scare him away, though. Harry set sail for Europe Friday, this time taking the northern route and following the Gulf Stream. If you want to track Harry's progress, go to our website at WPTV.com for a live tracker. James Whelan, WPTV News Channel 5.